Today I'm going to show you how to design a cat bowl in Vision 360. Alright, so we first create a sketch, uh, select the top plane, go to the top view, we select the circle sketch and create a 100mm uh, circle, then we select the ellipse tool, we create the ears of the cat, remember we are creating a cat food container, so Alright, so you click on finish the sketch, click on extrude, select both the profiles, give a little bit perspective and extrude it to 50 or let's say um, 30 mm. I think yeah, 30 mm should be fine. Uh, we go to modify, split the body, select the mid plane as a splitting tool, delete the other half without the ear and we just mirror the left side to the right. Go to combine, select both the pieces and click on OK. We need to shell the body, uh, let's say around um, 0.5 or I think uh, 2mm, yeah, 2mm should be fine. Let's focus on the emboss tool now, uh, so we need to create an offset plane first. We create an offset plane, move the plane a little bit forward, this way it's easy to, easy to see. Click on create sketch, select the plane, go to the front view, go to create, select text, click. And then we should be able to type the name that we want to emboss or deboss in this case. Um, well, let's write Simba Sood because my cat's name is Simba. So yeah, Simba's foot should be fine. Uh, we need to flip the horizontal and vertical. Increase the size of it. Maybe 20 mm should be fine. Let's move it. Uh, move the text. Uh, right click, move copy. Okay, so we select the the point and move it. Okay, finish sketch. All right, so now we can deboss or emboss the text. Select the face as we already had the sketch profile selected before. So we select the face, and as you can see, we have Simba's food embossed on the model. Um, maybe one of them should be fine, uh, but in this case, I actually want to deboss it. I don't want to emboss uh, the name. I want it to be debossed, like subtracted from the model. So let's click on deboss and subtracted. Click on OK. And uh, as you can see, we have the name um, debossed. We have the name debossed. As you can see, Simba's food clearly. Uh, let's uh, smooth the edges. Uh, we need to add some fillet. Um, give it around 0 0.5 or I think yeah, 0 0.5 should be fine. We, we don't want to harm the cat. <laughs> we want to make sure the cat uh, eats the food without getting injured. So we give it uh, some fillet. So now let's uh, save the file, the STL file. First of all, we double click it and rename it to ball. Save the STL. Save the file. Alright, so now I have simplified 3D open on my Mac. And here I have the model on the build plate. So I can just rotate the mouse. I can just rotate the view and yeah, have a look around. Go to prepare to print. I have all my settings dialed in already. For my printer, the settings I usually use with the raft to have a good addition for the first layer. So yeah, uh, here is the model as you can see it will take around 4 hours and 39 minutes to finish. So I'm gonna use a TVO to Nado 3D printer to print it using an orange PLA because that's the one I have right now. So let's uh, see you on the other side. 